now the foundation of artificial intelligence as we can see there is the in big black circle the artificial intelligence is written and the foundation is written on the right side the, what is the foundation of the artificial intelligence the philosophy where does the knowledge came from the linguistics how does the language related to thought process neuroscience how do our brains process informations behavioral economics how do you make decision to maximum utility mathematics what can be computed computer science how can we build an efficient computer this is the general foundation of artificial intelligence now the history of artificial intelligence the history as we know it's 1943 the inception art of artificial intelligence is started that is in 1943 to 1953 and in 1952 to 1969 early enthusiasm great expectation are occurred and a dose reality 1966 to 1973 occurred expert system 1969 to 1986 the return of neural networks 1986 to till present neural networks it come to the next coming sessions the probabilistic reasoning and the machine learning 97 1987 to present big data 2001 present and deep learning 2011 to till present everyone seems to be talking about artificial intelligence these days it is good to remember that ai is not something new post world war 2 a variety of field begins to discuss the possibility of creating an artificial brain here is a brief artificial intelligence history as we can see in the timeline the 1950s the turning test occurred 1955 ai is born 1961 Unimet, 1964, Eliza, 1966, Shaki, AI Winter, 1997, Deep Blue, 1998, Kismet, 1999, AI Bio, 2002, Rumbie, 2011, Sasser, 2011 Watson 2014 Eugene 14 Alexa 16 Tay 17 Alpha Alpha Go This is the timeline history for AI Into the next to the slide this is another timeline explain as you can go through it with the help of the schematic diagrams they are explain a lot of things this is generally just know what are which are those years they have set the benchmarks for it now history of artificial into some this is the in 1950s the engineering of making intelligence machining and programs from 1950s to 1970 and 1980s to 2006 the ability to learn without being explicitly and program and 2010 to 2016 learning based on deep neural networks this is a general historical mapping of the artificial intelligence in different branches or different stream now come to the next slide is data science the data science is the term of the whole set of tools and technique which is used to analyze the data and extract insight from it it makes use of scientific method process and algorithm to make this happens essentially it's goal to discover hidden pattern in raw data to help business improve and increase their profits the term came up we Bazzardo went in 2000 till Harvard Business Review called the 
सेक्सीज जॉब ऑफ द टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट सेंचुरी मॉडल बिल्डिंग एम कम्युनिकेटिंग रिजल्ट इट इज़ अ फील्ड कंसर्न विद एक्सट्रैक्टिंग इन साइट फ्रॉम द डेटा मेकिंग ऑफ साइंटिफिक मेथड एंड एलगोरिदम्स टू बिजनेस कैन बी बेनिफिट डेटा साइंस यूजेस मशीन लर्निंग एंड एनालाइज डेटा एंड मेक प्रडिक्शंस दैट कैन ऑल्सो बी यूज टू यूटिलियन प्रोस्पेक्ट्स डेटा साइंस combines ml with big data analytics and clouds computing as as an apparent in diagram it has much in common with all artificial intelligence and machine learning and deep learning so this is the very useful diagram where we can learn artificial intelligence in big blue circle in in which it consists of machine learning machine learning that is a small circle yellow circle and another inside of that that is a deep learning that is a green circle and the other outer side circle is the data science which is overlapped with of artificial intelligence machine learning and deep learning now as we can see this the data science and big data is outside of that circle so this is with generally how they process the artificial intelligence get the data with the help of the data science it process with the help of the machine learning and the deep learning uses the algorithms to process the results this is how the data science works so this is the basic things where we know that what is the data science so data science it is a not main part of artificial intelligence but it required artificial intelligence or data science required artificial intelligence or vice versa artificial intelligence required data science to process the things to carry out the results now comparison of ai with data on the left column the factors in the middle column the data science on the right column the artificial intelligence on the left side the factor consisting of scope types of data tools and the center or middle middle column data science involves various understanding underlying the data operations structure and structures python saas spps advertising marketing internet search engines limited and the uh, artificial intelligence limited to the implementation of ml algorithms standardization in the forms of uh, embedding and vectors scikit learning pyrotorch tensor flow shogun manufacturing automation robotics transport healthcare this is the comparison now we, this is just what factors which are perfect like this for example i will take this with the help of this uh, the factors in the factors column the applications are there and in which the application may consist of the data science the advertisement marketing internet search engines and the artificial play in which the data science is the manufacturing automation robotics transport healthcare so this is the factors data science artificial intelligence the need of ai in mechanical to take the advantage of the potential of ai and the machine learning by using generative engineering creating value from historical data tapping into data source exploit experimental and simulation data taking preventive actions before and predicted failure occurs designing new from old concept optimizing existing and new products now the first one is using generative engineering using generative engineering is nothing but to generate ai or to create a new things with the help of the ai to combination combinations of the various data with the help of the ai and machine learning now the creating value from historical data now suppose we have one set which is have 1990s based another set is 
another third set is 1992 and another fourth set is 1994 that this four year data set i used to create a new combination or new technology and form in 2022 so this is nothing but a create values from historical data now the third is a tapping into a data source so the whatever the data sets having so we have to root the data or we have to uh, what we call indexing the data is nothing but the tapping into data sources or to finding out the data source where it is came from and index them so we will later on we can identify those exploit experimental and simulation data so grab much more amount of experimental data and simulation data so that will help in the future studies taking preventive action before a predicted failures occurs this is a self-explanatory designing new from old concepts suppose i have an old simple mo button mobile nowadays we can see everybody using a touch screen android mobile so this is a revolution from old concept to new concepts optimizing existing and new products this is same as you told as i give the phone example optimize existing product and create a new one now vehicle this is another textural formats the vehicle manufacturer across to the world implement artificial intelligence to rapid pace into their processes so the artificial intelligence is automotive industries can be helped improve design process increase accuracy or speed of the product development AI and ML will revolutionize how business is conducted the advantage of the potential of AI automotive engineering process are early concept evaluate, evaluate the best mechatronics design target setting and benchmarking CA optimization product validations productive maintenance this is the, all the self explanatory now the AI helping a complex CAD merging of AI and CAD is done through the model based reasoning. Many new releases of the software packages are using knowledge based system. A major field to the application AI is generative design. SolidWorks gives a feature to topology optimization in 2018. That is, when you come to the uh, last year now, there is a topologization order for the elements that is deals with the finite element analysis and they and we. In our college we use ANSYS as a uh, meshing of the critical geometry and that topological meshing element is occurred and in, in which the meshed element have the topological order that we will learn in actual way when this finite element analysis subject come to the next semester so the next point is the artificial neural networks in CFD artificial neural networks ANN are gathering interest in academia for the potential to give approximation to flow with less computing power and uh, time and dimensional reduction of the problem that is the CFD process the IOT and data analysis that is the, this is the fourth revolution IOT and data analysis the IOT is nothing but internet of things internet of things and data analysis is going to machine optimization is basically that machine can itself get internet access and it will use AI yeah, to think to get the solution for whatever you kind of facing the problem so it will be quick reactive the things okay now the need of AI in mechanical engineering the rotating machinery system data acquisition feature extraction fault recognition in which the rotating machinery system is also go by side with the designing, assembly, etc. Second one is the data acquisition is also deals with the vibration, acoustic data, temperature, pressure. The second is the micro sensor, acoustic emissions, and the feature extraction is demand of physical model prior knowledge at AI. The feature extraction uh, and the fault recognition is a uh, demand of features pattern recognitions with KNN, SVM and neural networks this is the need of AI